going to show you how to never lose money in cryptocurrency ever again, and in fact, lock in your gains and your profits. So it's very simple. First off, it's never guaranteed 100%, but this is a little known secret that will make it much safer to trade cryptocurrency and much more profitable. So you want to find a platform that offers stop losses, such as KuCoin. A stop loss is very simple. It stops your loss. You choose the percent you're willing to lose, maybe 20%, maybe 5%, and when it hits that threshold, it will pull your money out for you, even if you're not at the computer to do it yourself. So even if it were to crash completely, you are safe, which locks in your and your profits and your gains. So what I do is on KuCoin, I bought, for example, Theta. I'm not recommending Theta, just what I bought, what I'm trading right now. What you do is you buy it. Once you've bought it, you go to sell, you hit the limit button, go to stop limit. Look at the current price, 3.48 right now, okay? You go to your calculator, 3.48. In my case, I'm only willing to lose 6%. That's the risk I'm willing to take. So I do times... 0.94, which would be 6%, right? So you do the difference. So if you wanted to lose 20%, that's the maximum you're willing to risk, you do times 0.8. Make sense? I'm doing 0.94 because I'm willing to lose 6% maximum. Equals, that's the number you want your stop loss at, okay? Top number is what it notifies the system at. So I do 3.27. So it will notify the system at 3.27 to get ready for your stop loss. Then you do a few cent difference, 3.25. 0.25, okay? And that's the price you'll actually execute your stop loss at and pull it out. You want to do a few cent difference here. Uh, if it's like a $100, $1,000 cryptocurrency, then do a few dollar difference. Um, if it's only a few bucks, then do a few cent difference. Make sense? Great. You want to do 100% of it, or you can do 50, 75, whatever you want. I always do 100%, so in case it crashes, my money is fully pulled out, and I don't incur that loss. You hit done, and then you hit the sell button, and that's it. Now you're probably saying, that's great. That stops my loss, but how do I lock in my savings? Okay, simple. Here's your stop order. Whenever it goes up at least 3%, 3% in gains, you cancel your stop loss and now redo it at the new price. So by canceling it and redoing it at the new 3% higher price, you're now adjusting that stop loss 3% higher, locking in the money you have gained. I hope this was helpful. Please like, comment, and share so I can post more of these.